Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, the U.S. Director of the Apostleship of Prayer, the Pope's Worldwide Prayer Network. Today, Pope Francis begins his first visit to Africa, arriving in Kenya, a country of 14 million Catholics that has been torn by terrible violence in recent times. Two years ago, the terrorist group Al-Shabaab attacked the Westgate shopping mall and killed 67 people while injuring over 200. And just last April, the same group killed 148 people, mostly Christian students, at Garissa University College. Thus, it's no surprise that the theme of the Pope's visit is stand firm and be strong. The Cardinal Archbishop of Nairobi, the capital of Kenya, told his flock that the Pope is coming to bring a message of peace and hope to a country torn by interreligious violence and tribal conflicts. Last April, when he met in Rome with the bishops of Kenya, Pope Francis told them, Dear brothers, the church in Kenya must always be true to her mission as an instrument of reconciliation, justice, and peace. In fidelity to the entire patrimony of the faith and the moral teaching of the church, may you strengthen your commitment to working with Christian and non-Christian leaders alike in promoting peace and justice in your country through dialogue, fraternity, and friendship. In this way, you will be able to offer a more unified and courageous denunciation of all violence, especially that committed in the name of God. Good words, I think, not only for our brothers and sisters in Kenya, but also for us. May God keep Pope Francis safe as he reaches out in peace to Africans and to all of us.